Good morning and welcome to module 1 of day 9 in the bridge course in English language offered by Sri Sharda Bhavan Education Society's Yashwant Mahavidyalaya Nanded. In this module 1 today, we will talk about our helpers in the society. I want many things to be answered by you. I will be introducing you to many of the people who help us in the society, but I want you to identify the names of the instruments that are used by these helpers by yourselves and do the assignments properly. Let's have a discussion on the helpers in the society. The very first helper that you have the moment you come out of the house right from your childhood is your teacher at the school level and on the right side you could see at the college level. The teachers are called as gurus in the ancient days. The difference between teachers and guru is that a teacher is a person who just teaches whatever is prescribed in the syllabus. And of course expecting a sort of payment for it back. And a guru is that that gives you the overall knowledge about you yourself, this cosmos, your existence and your goals of life. Normally, a guru is not supposed to expect anything back. We celebrate both Guru Purnima as well as Teacher's Day. The Teacher's Day is, yes, that's right, that's right. It is September 5th. Do you know why do we celebrate Teacher's Day? Yes, that is the birthday of Dr. Sarve Pali Radha Krishnan the wonderful teacher, an erudite scholar of Sanskrit and a person who has introduced the scriptures and Sanskrit knowledge to the western world, a wonderful orator, a voracious reader and a beautiful writer. His birthday is celebrated as the teacher's day in India. Guru Purnima, we just had Guru Purnima uh, a few days back. Um, it is the Purnima that comes in Ashad Bhans that is celebrated as Guru Purnima or Vyasa Purnima because it is on that day that the greatest of the Gurus, Vyas Maharishi, born. Celebrate Guru Purnima and wish your teachers. Celebrate also Teacher's Day and wish your teachers because it is only because of the teachers that we are able to make up whatever we are in our life. Always pay gratitude and as Vivekananda says, gratitude is one thing that you have to pay to everyone that is shaping your life, your parents, your teachers and everybody else surrounding. The second that you could find in case of emergency of the health issues is a doctor. Yes, a doctor is a person who takes care of you in your bad health and helps you to recover a healthy life again. In the Indian context, these doctors are called as Ayurveda Acharyas. But in the Western context, uh, they are called as doctors and the doctors are normally helped by the nurses. Uh, the nurse could be a female or maybe a male. A nurse is a person who nurses you. The nurse can be a female when we call as sister and could be a male and we call as brother and we are helped by these doctors, nurses uh, to recoup good health. In this COVID-19 situation, to come out of this pandemic disease that has broken across the world, it is the doctors and nurses that have been uh, doing their best so we always should thank the doctors and nurses that really make us healthy again. These are some of the basic instruments that the doctors uh, should be having or the hospitals are equipped with. Uh, I want you to understand all these instruments. A stethoscope, as all of us know what a stethoscope is, and a pulse oximeter, the syringes, body weight scales, eye charts, thermometer, blood pressure monitor, autoclave and automated external defibrillator. 
all these are the basic instruments that a doctor is supposed to have. I want all of you to understand what these instruments are in terms of the pictures and in terms of the use. The third that we have is 